Welcome back to, sorry. God. Welcome back to another episode of Money Mindset where we talk finance, investing, and business. Today I'm going to be talking about how you can start flipping things online. Now let's just jump right into it. Flipping things online is so easy and it's very, very simple. I do this all the time. I know I probably show you guys that I make $300 a day, $200 a day, $100 a day consistently selling stuff online through Amazon. And if you haven't already, please go check out my Instagram page, messy underscore 617, and then you'll see I usually post a story every single day about something productive when it comes to stocks or it comes to business. What I've learned is that the internet is a crazy, crazy good resource for making money no matter what you look like, what age you are, uh, how long you've been selling. It doesn't matter because the internet gives you the option to do whatever you like. I make money in my sleep because of the internet and I think that you should too. And let me just explain to you exactly how I do that in my next venture that I just had started a couple days ago and I'll show you the websites of well, where I get product and where you know I start to flip them. So essentially you would like to buy things low and sell them high. Now this might seem like a simple, simple concept, but it actually takes skill and you have to find uh, the products or just like in stock market, you have to find a low stock and, and sell it when it is high. That's the name of the game. It sounds very simple, but it does take a couple skills and you know some time to learn. So I'll try to teach you a little bit about what I do and how I find deals and how I find products or stocks to flip to buy low and sell high. So the new venture that I had actually taken, I had learned from this lady named Ashley Johnson. She has a big brother named Chris Johnson and they talk investing uh, you know, in stocks, starting your own business, and flipping stuff online for low and selling high. So follow them and they have a ton of good courses. I think I bought four or five courses that like gave me so much information, so much game uh, for just a little under a hundred dollars. Like you can't beat that. So definitely if you haven't bought their course and if you want to learn about what I'm doing and what they're doing, definitely go buy their course. Definitely highly, highly recommend it. Now let me jump into what I had found when I had, like I said, took Ashley Johnson's course. So what it is called, it's called pallet flipping. Now I knew about flipping things like going to the thrift store, finding stuff for low and selling them high. But I would have to go out and you know, essentially find the items and stuff like that and take hours and hours and hours going through the store, actually driving there, uh, spending gas money and stuff like that. So I actually took a course and found out that you could pallet flip online. And you could do it in a warehouse too. First couple of packages that I ordered were through an online website. Okay. So if we bring the laptop right in front of me, here is the page that I have bought two boxes of goods. Now it is called Quick Lots. All the links in this video I'm gonna leave down below in the description. So definitely check it out for yourself. I'm giving you free game here. So this is Quick Lots. So Quick Lots, this is where you could buy pallets. And pallets are essentially liquidation items that are being sold at a very, very cheap price so that potentially you could buy it and you could flip it online on the various different, the various different selling websites I'm gonna show you in the future. So let's just go over Quick Lots. Um, you could order cases, which I actually did, and I'll show you exactly what that looks like. Uh, pallets, mixed pallets, lighting pallets, and truckloads of stuff. And here are some of the other things you could buy on this website. So let's just go to cases and go to mystery boxes because that's what I ordered. I ordered two mystery boxes. I ordered a mystery box for, what was it called? Right here for about $240, but I paid $290. I, I think the listing is out of here, but um, it comes with a bunch of stuff in it that could go for retail price. So it's a lot of brand new items that have never been touched and they just pull it from the shelf and put it all in a box. I had gotten 99 things to sell. So we we're going to, I'm gonna, and I'm gonna show you the whole process when I do sell it and everything like that. And I'll keep you guys updated on my Instagram. So like I said, go follow it, go check it out. That's what I got one mystery box right here. And then I got electronic mystery box, which is interesting because 
I know electronics definitely go for good money, so definitely flipping this would be so, so easy. Now, if we go into this, it shows you right here a little description about what's in the box and what potentially is in the box. So 30 items in the box, average retail value per item is $20 or higher. It says retail value per box is typically 1,200 or more. Now, I have bought this for $350, so if I could do the math, 1,200 minus 350, that leaves me with about $850. So definitely worth why would you not want to try it so that's what I, exactly what i did bought it so as you can see miss mix of guest returns shelf pulls overstocks so everything right here incredible merchandise for online sellers flea market and small retailers so you buy this for the low and then you would flip it for the high or for retail price that's pretty much it they have pallets right here mix palettes as you can see you could buy a whole electronic palette and this is what the palette looks like a bulk palette monster palette they got so many things man it's crazy uh and you can even buy a truckload which would be a lot more expensive but look at the picture this is all the stuff you would get for about fifty eight hundred dollars and I, i'd imagine that they all sell for a lot higher than what it actually is now let's go to bulk iq now i haven't ordered anything from this website but i'm going to in the future because definitely they look like they got some good stuff um you can see under category there's a ton of different categories about what you want to sell and what you want to buy um right here there's a bunch of stuff tablets apple um apple products amazon products laptop monitors and you could buy this stuff for about let's say this one right here for twenty three hundred dollars and it tells you original retail price is thirty eight hundred dollars and there's 19 items in it so if you could buy this for twenty three hundred and flip it for thirty eight hundred would you do it i definitely would do it um but these are the more expensive things so you would need to come up with a little bit more money to invest initially at first right here there's there's a three thousand nine hundred fourteen dollars and original retail is seventy four hundred apple tablets Amazon tablets and thirty nine seventy eight, and you can sell it for six thousand eight hundred. They got these deals all day long. So this is the online stuff that I was telling you about. But I have to do more research and find out where there are warehouses that I could go into in person and actually look at the bulk palette and actually see if I could actually make my money back on it in person, which would be nice. So now. When it comes to selling the product, there is a couple websites I'm going to be using that I'm going to be selling these products to over the next few weeks and months. So Facebook right here, if you click at the top, if you go to your news feed, right, and you click at the top marketplace, click on that, and this is exactly where, as you can see right here, I got an email saying, Chris Johnson, you bought Whiteboard Magic. They got a lot of good courses, so definitely go get that. But like I said, Marketplace is where you would flip these things. So you could browse. They sell everything here on Marketplace. This is people selling stuff that they have to other people that potentially want to buy their stuff. They sell houses. They sell games. They sell humidifiers. Anything you can think of, Facebook Marketplace has. A trick to flipping things for low and selling them high, you can't get lower than free. So they have a free section where, I can't, let me see, hold on. They have a free section. Cancel. Oh, right here, free stuff. If you click on that, this shows everything that's free that you could just pick up from the owner and flip it online. As you can see, there's free books right here. You could flip, um, cause guys, you're paying nothing for these, these things. I mean, there's a bunch of movies right here. There are more books, a backpack that's free that you could flip it for 20 bucks. I mean, there's so many things you have, uh, free, uh, ATV for trade. Uh, f there's, there's a bunch, a bunch of free things that you could flip for, money so definitely check that out when you're on facebook marketplace so that's how you would flip the things you would get from i don't know the thrift store if you are going to the thrift store or if you're going to the warehouse to buy the bulk pallets or you can go online and order the bulk pallet yourself and you would list them onto facebook marketplace another website is mercari and you can search for anything right here and it's the same thing as facebook 
uh, but it, but this is where you sell through like online so you wouldn't be meeting up with people face to face um, so people would put their items on here and they would sell it to you or potential people uh, you can set the shipping price and everything like that and delivery time so this is where I would be selling stuff as well and last but not least we've probably all heard of it just like we've all heard of Amazon and that is eBay so eBay you have a ton of ton of stuff that you could buy and sell and you could flip so once you get those pallets you break it down and you can search how you could search is you know you look up the item name and then you can see what it has sold for and then you could base your prices off of what it has sold for in the past and flip that it's the easy easy thing now when i had gotten my palette uh, i had counted all the items and there were about a hundred items and i paid 295 so you do the math that is around two dollars and 95 cents per product so all i got to do is sell each product higher than two dollars and 95 cents and i will make a profit so if you haven't already please guys like i said please check out the websites down below and thank you guys for watching i will show you my journey in my social media page so definitely go follow my instagram page and go check out those people's courses the johnson family courses and they'll show you uh just for a couple bucks they'll show you exactly how everything is done from you know investing into stocks starting shopify's and also pallet flipping so do yourself a favor and do me a favor smash that like button and definitely subscribe to the channel if you want to continue learning more about making money and buying investments all right i'll see you guys in the next video peace out